Hello everybody, I'm back again. So today I wanted to continue to work on this journal. I'm not sure where I'm going, what I'm going to work on, I guess is what I'm trying to say. But I do have some pages that I do want to finish collaging. I'm debating on this one. But, um, I did go ahead and add some of these little snippet thingies that I have already made. I need to cover this. I did decorate this pocket off camera. Um, and that one. <laughs> but most of them are, are, um, are blank, so we have some decorating to do. But let's see. Just want to see how many pages do I still need to collage. So it's mainly the pockets. This one I printed it twice and I added it. But I'm going to cover one of them because they're identical. So I'm thinking, you know, adding something here and just covering that oh this one is the one that I need to collage and maybe leave this that one for journaling and then this one here I'm thinking too this one here as well and I still have the envelope here that I need to do and I put some of the some of them are in there not a whole lot but I, I added some oh I did do this one I thought I hadn't done this one this one I went ahead and collaged um, well not collage this is one of the pieces that came from uh, your creative studio I just backed it to a a piece of like cardstock right or book page no it was a book page and then I tore a piece just to have a little you know little insert to just tuck some stuff in there so yeah and then we still have the tuck inside the envelope so i just went ahead and punched the hole there and i'm not sure exactly what i'm going to put there yet but um this is one of the pages i'm thinking of uh i'm like what is that anyways i'm thinking of call out ah, collage here but i just realized that i think i already ran out of paint i only have whoops and we have small pieces. Um, I got to turn off on that light. But let me see what I have. I know I have a lot of these. I'm wondering. Okay, put that book aside. Hope you all are doing good. Oh, I've been a busy bee throughout the house. Just so much. So much. Okay, so I need to cut that piece. So for now, I'm going to say about there. And where's my pencil? use this one. I took the other one with my son to do homework because he couldn't find his pencil. And I think I left it over there. So, wait a minute. I have to cut this way first because the paper's too big. I'm going to say from there to there. come over here and cut this piece off and then I gotta take the little edge here which well I could still cut that off 
Okay. So I'll just throw this in my little bin over there. And let's see how much do we need to trim off. If we need to trim off. No, that's perfect. Okay, so move you over there and I'm just gonna just slightly distress the um the edges. Does anybody see my lid? Oh, I see it. So then I'm going to bring this back and I'm going to say there. calling me guys okay I'm gonna have to disappear I'm gonna pause you guys I'm not going anywhere <laughs> it always happens every time I try to get some time to myself you know and do stuff something happens so we got to do this page now I'm probably what I'm thinking maybe I should um print some papers. I like that one. Okay, let me go see what my neighbor needs. Um, she lives by herself, so I keep an eye on her, you know? So, give me a quick second. I'll be right back, guys. I'm gonna pause you guys for a bit, okay? Don't go nowhere. We're not done. Okay. Okay, guys, I'm back. So, let's see. I was thinking of using this piece here. Oh, I did mark it. So that can go there. of uh, bits and pieces here. That can work too. Okay, so I'm going to pop that there. Feel my little bottle of glue here. It's going down.
really pretty paper. Can't remember who's it from. I don't know if I want to pop that there or pop some of this here. Um, because see, I just have small pieces like that from the the kit. Just bits and pieces. I think I pretty much used everything. Let's see. Yeah, I didn't think I should have remembered to. That's a different color. And we have these. And what I'm going to add that. say right there I'm gonna cut it right here have not been able to do my little video to share the my gray color that I created for my stains um, I love the color and um, I want to share it I already listed it for those of you that are interested so maybe I try to see if I could do it today if not tomorrow because I should have done that a long time ago But, you know, you know how life is, especially with me. And then, um, move that over there. And I'm thinking... that piece there or not like that just to um, help with the collaging just to you know make it work connect been so so hot over here guys <gasps> oh it got stuck to my shorts oops but it's been so hot over here like oh my goodness you can like easily bake Southern California, and oh my goodness, it's freaking hot. Okay, so that one, I'm gonna call it done. Make sure there's no glue. And then, this one we need to cover here. This is a, this is, I printed, I created a new kit, guys. It's on my shop, and, um, I took the ephemera from that one and popped it there. So I'm thinking I'm going to use some of this and some of this. So let me put my book like this and where is my ruler? Okay, we're not going to use the ruler today. We are, I don't want to get up and look for it. I always pop it everywhere but where it's supposed to go. But 
That's fine. We got the paper trimmer here. And then the other piece, take this edge off, and I think So I'm thinking of mixing it up with this one. So I'm just going to cut like that. And then I'm just going to grab my glue. And pop that there. Whoops. Then I had a... A little, bit, a little bit of a cold and I thought, oh my God, I probably got COVID, but thank God it came out negative. So I don't know if I'm getting the flu or it's just my allergies really acting up. Sorry for my big head, guys. But I'd rather it be that than COVID. Okay, so then I'm gonna grab this piece and I'm gonna pop a piece there. So I need my paper trimmer real quick and I'm gonna say Been, um, every night I've been trying to eat an oatmeal like before bedtime you know as my dinner because I always say oatmeal is like my my uh, pick-me-up when I'm sick or just feel tired down worn out man um, oatmeal really really picks me up the next day I'm just like nothing I have to come back and trim a little bit on this one. But for now, I'm leaving that alone. And I want, oh, put this back in there. And then there was the envelope, I think. This one, I don't know. But I'll come back to that one. Then here, I'm thinking of move my phone out of the way. I have one of these corner ones. Let me make sure I don't have another one. No, I was thinking of popping that one there. And my little decoration thingies. I was thinking of using one of these um, bingo cards and then adding this little guy right there. So let's glue this down. I want to add some cheesecloth. I, I don't want to show the picture because <laughs> there's a picture of my neighbor. She asked me to make her a copy of her driver's license and knucklehead me forgot I had cardstock. I didn't have paper, so I had to print it again. But, you know. So, yeah, her face is in the back. <laughs> okay, so. I'm getting all gluey. So. 
So I'm gonna say there. And then this guy, oh, this is what I wanted to say too, that this little guy came from, I have actually two kits. Well, now it's gonna be three, but I haven't cut out the other ones. But these are two kits of these images that I got from two different shops. And I thought, oh, those will go perfect with this kit. So I, I printed some out and these are from, don't mind my, my writing, but some of them that I purchased are from my white cat journal but those aren't the ones I'm using right now, but I'm sure I will be using hers too. And um, these are the ones that I got from, I think it's Lois Haynes. I don't know, I may not be pronouncing it right guys, but that's her on Etsy, that's their name on Etsy. So if you guys wanna check it out and wanna get some of these little guys, cause they're really, they're really cute, look at that. You know, they're really cute. <clears throat> and they, I think they go very, very good with this um, kit. There. So I will put that over there for now. But yeah, I want to add uh, a little bit of cheesecloth which I don't know if I should do that now because I haven't been doing that as you can see on these other pockets like this one I did add that little stamp there but I haven't added anything I want to add a little bit of fibers I just like that look so for now I'll pop this down oh yeah I printed it out and as you can see um I didn't um I didn't mark you know how you can put shrink to fit uh, the full page I didn't do that so this one didn't print out that well but I don't throw it away I just flip it over and reprint on it or I collage on them but you know you can't throw away good paper so yeah I did that guys and it covers the what was a message that it said so yeah press down really good make sure it doesn't lift okay so a sip of my soda okay so for now I'm leaving that one alone I'm just trying to finish the collaging part here the golfing I need to come and cover that too but I don't want to cover the whole thing so I'm leaving that one as is for now this one I was thinking of covering but at the same time I don't because I was thinking of adding a pocket, not this one, because I don't think this one would... Oh, no, it does fit. Yeah, I was thinking of adding a pocket there. So we'll see what we do with that one. But this one, this is a little tuck there. I think the other one is... Oh, and this one, too. We need to cover this. Put my paper trimmer right there. So I still have these here. I'm not sure if they're the same size. I may, sorry guys, may have to do a little bit of a trimming right there. Okay, so. back so I'm going to cut there and I'm going to put this piece right there
Okay. Sorry if my head's on the way, guys. But when you're blind, you gotta get as close as you can. <laughs> Okay, so that one is there. And then I have this piece from the other one. Now, I know this one was a tad... Sorry for my head again. There I go. Hopefully, I don't have any bald spots that you guys may look... May be looking at. Okay. So, I just need to trim a little bit. writing on the top. Goodness, I think it's still a little bigger than me. Yep, it is. Okay, another one we need to come back with the scissors. So leave that one alone for now. Keep going. Oh, we need this one. This one, it's got writing there, but I'm gonna have to cover it. So let's see. I just saw this one that fell off, and it looks like it might be the perfect size. I have a napkin and get a piece of paper here from the trash. Take that little piece of dry glue off. Oh, wait a minute. I just saw a little ant on my hand and my daughter um, always throws bags of chips or soda whatever she's drinking and I told her many times don't throw anything there because the ants are you know in season and I think there's ants in there because I just grabbed a paper to clean my glue and uh, one jumped on me okay so I'm going to pop this one in the middle Then I'm gonna add a little bit of glue here just to close this piece here because I'm not planning on using it. If it was bigger, I probably would have left it to do a little, you know, a little tag in there. But I did not. So okay, that one's there. So now let me bring this basket closer to me. I really like this color. I think I'm gonna add a piece of this, so let's see. Guess I'll cut it in half. Because it won't fit the long way. Whoops. Now I'm thinking of putting a piece on the top. So if I pop it there.
this one way on the top here. And it kind of matches with the paper that's already there. So that's good. And then this one, I could pop it here, but then I'm not sure I like that. So, um, where are those small pieces I had? Let me see if one of these. to do a little bit of trimming there. Which I still show the edge there. I guess I didn't cut this very well. it looks if I distress that edge and if not then we cover it okay we'll leave it alone we're good with that. And then I think now we just have, oh no, we have this one too. Gotta cover this right here. So, it's ready. Put it right there. Thank you, babe. Abby did some cooking. Where'd my page go? This one. Hubby did some cooking and he just brought me some tacos. So I guess I'm forced to take a break, but I don't like my food really hot, so I'm just gonna let it chill there for a bit. And while I do this. So that one, see this is a kit too that I never um, used. And this one is from, um, Shabby Dabby Duda. But it came out a little blurry. That's why I didn't use it. So I don't know when my printer was being a, a wacky that day, but it was blurry, so I didn't use it. And I have not tried to print it out again, so. Okay, so that one's gonna go there. But actually, you know what? What if I make a pocket like that? But I need to, shall we put some of this paper on the bottom? Or leave that one, that kind of looks cool because it, you know, 
ma uh, matches with that one but I'm thinking of doing it like I did on the other one and then you can just you know insert stuff in there but the question is do we want to leave that there or do we want to cover it and add some of this and then this one yeah okay, I'm going to do that okay so we'll pop you to the side and then I guess I'll pick this side so let's pop it make sure we have it there and then I'm gonna say there so let's see so I don't need the whole paper but where is my rounder there it is I'm gonna use the quarter inch one well that one will go there I mean um I guess I could glue the whole thing, make it, you know, it doesn't hurt to make that page a little more sturdier. So we'll just leave it then. Okay, I don't want to do that with the trash anymore. Let me get from this little trash bin right here. Get a piece of paper that I've thrown just to clear that. This piece is going to get decorated, but we need to, um, I have a piece of cardstock. We need to get it a little, you know, sturdier. Let's see if I have anything in this. My little magic basket here that has all kinds of stuff. I don't even know what's in here. This is the one I carry with me everywhere. And I... I usually have my own basket for all my little scraps, but this one has been serving as pretty much anything and everything. Where's a piece of cardstock? See, that coffee died the day I dropped my coffee, but it still works. Let's pop it there. Can you tell I didn't cut it straight? <laughs> so I'm gonna pop this baby here. Try 
to straighten this little edge here. Should have waited for the glue to dry. Every time I do that, it does a little thing there. But who wants to wait for it to dry? Not me. So then we need to distress this. Okay, now I'm just trying to get as close as I can to my original tear. Distress my edge here. Now this one will go here. Since I glued it, I don't think I'm gonna, whoops, wrong glue. I don't think I'm gonna sew around it, or should I? No, I'm not gonna sew around it. Just put glue on these three sides, whoops. Big hit, guys. It's a good thing about wet glue. If you don't, you know, lay it straight, you still have the ability to move it around. Shoot, some of the glue sit right there, guys. So that will be my little little pocket, and I guess I'll use this to just whoops down here, so that I can get as close to the bottom as I can to distress this. And here, just gonna. Then on this side, I probably will leave that like that for now. So there, we have that one. And okay, so this is the other one and actually this one too because I want to enforce this and then we need to cover that little I'll probably cover this because it looks like it got stained from something there. So now let's see what papers do we have. Because like I said, I don't have very more very much papers. Do I have any here in the old ones? have another bin of, of just uh, papers and they're random see that's for a bee journal that apparently I did front and back and I still haven't done it oh. I think this is from the bee kit Still, so yeah, not those. 
because we need to do another bee journal. Okay, not those. I just don't want to have to print papers again. Yesterday I did some printing and I don't feel like doing that today, guys. Okay, let's see if we can make it work with these. So, about these pop them over there so I kind of am liking this Alright guys, I gotta take a quick pause. 